Absolutely, especially if you go and visit the folks at the Cheese Cottage. Guys, introduce yourselves this morning. Uh, I'm Austin Egbert with the Cheese Cottage, and this is Charles Barber. All right, guys, well, thank you so much for being here. Thank and you. I see this uh, huge wheel of cheese over here. What do we got going uh, on, yes. fellas? So uh, today we're doing a raclette. So this is a traditional uh, Swiss meal. Dates back about 400 years. So this is what typically when it gets colder outside, this is what they do as a family meal, and they put it over potatoes and vegetables ah, and that kind of stuff. That sounds great. Yeah, so this great. is a, a whole half wheel of raclette. Raclette, I yes, like sir. that. I see in addition you brought a lot of other stuff too. Tell me about that box we have up Oh yeah, so um, all of our stuff inside, we have a big grocery section in the front, it's, uh, including our menu, but these are some gift boxes we brought to show that what we could kind of do for, you want to give some gifts this holiday season. What type of stuff you got in there? Oh, so we've got some wine, we've got some uh, Greek olives, we got a couple different types of cheeses, some raclette, uh, a pesto aioli, some chocolate covered almonds, just. Man. You are making me hungry, my <laughs> friend. So for the folks who have had a chance to get out to the Cheese Cottage yet, tell them a little bit about the Cheese Cottage. Yeah, so uh, we're at 650 St. Louis Street, right there at the corner of Dearborn. Mm -hmm. We do um, cheese boards, sandwiches, salads. We have a big grocery section in the front. So prepackaged cheese, we cut cheese, we do all of it right there for you. So you can go in, you can leave with some cheese if you want, you can sit down and enjoy a great meal too. Is it mainly lunch or lunch and dinner? Uh, it's lunch and dinner. So uh, Tuesday through Saturday, we're open at 11 to 8, then Sunday 12 to for. Guys, and it is such a cool little spot. If you haven't had the chance to check it out, you absolutely have to. Wind is whipping through our microphones <laughs> out here this morning. So what are you working on over here? What's we got here? So we got some, uh, just some tri-color bell peppers and some onions. Okay. And we got some, uh, some Yukon gold potatoes over here that Ooh. we're boiling off so we can scrape that cheese on top. Well, we've got two segments to go to keep working on this dish. So we are excited to see how this comes together. Take a look at this cheese. It's starting to melt over there. <laughs> Take a look at that. So that is Reclette. So we're learning, I'm learning something new. You may have known about this already. I don't, but I am certainly excited to try it out. Sounds so good. Guys, where can the folks find out more information about the Cheese Cottage? Uh, the Cheese Cottage, you can find us on Facebook and our website. It's thecheesecottagellc.com. All right, sounds good. Cheese, potatoes, peppers, can't get much better than that, Chelsea. I'm excited. And thanks for joining us here on Studio 10. If you haven't been outside, you may want to grab a jacket and some fuzzy socks because it has gotten a little <laughs> chilly outside. Yes. We are here with our good friends Charles and Austin from the Cheese Cottage yes, making you. something yummy. We're so excited you guys are here. Yes, thank you. We appreciate it having us. Of course. Now, for folks who are just now tuning into the show, we want to remind them what we're making this morning. All right, so we're doing a traditional Swiss dish. This is called raclette and they uh, do it in the winter months over potatoes and onions and peppers and we've got that cooked off now and our potatoes are boiled and he's about to plate that up. Oh man, this looks And incredible. then we'll scrape this raclette. We're going to throw this on the heater and scrape it over the top when it's done. Oh yes. my goodness, you guys. This looks absolutely incredible. <laughs> now for folks at home who aren't familiar with the raclette cheese or this cheese specifically, what yeah. kind of flavor does it bring to the dish? Um, it's very creamy. You'll see it. It's super melty, a little nutty. It's uh, stinky when it cooks but incredibly tasting when you eat it. It. Mm. Yeah, and uh, we're going to be doing this every Wednesday night in the month of December. So uh, definitely come out and see us, and we'll uh, we'll be doing this the whole month. Yeah, so keep that in mind. Again, that starts next week. Next Wednesday, you can have this dish right there, and it yes. looks absolutely delicious. Now, the month of December, a lot of folks are thinking about Christmas presents. You guys have the perfect option. Oh, yeah, so we have... Um, all of these cheese boards we can do, we have a big grocery section in the front. You can come and get exactly what you want for your loved ones. They make perfect gifts. We can do it with or without cheeses. So if you want to ship it, we can do that. If you just want a wine box, we can do that and just some jams and jellies. Just really whatever you want makes a perfect gift for Christmas. Yeah, something that I love that these guys are doing, instead of having it prepackaged, you can pick what you want in there, which Absolutely. is an awesome option for you and your family members. That is such a delicious and great Christmas gift. Now we've got our cheese on under the heater. Yes, I've never heat. I've never seen how this like works before. So this oh, is just absolutely yes. mesmerizing to me. Yes. So you just put it under this little heater right here and it'll start bubbling and it'll just run off. It'll just be incredible. Oh I can't wait to <laughs> can't wait for that to happen. Of course I'll show you right here. But we want to talk about where you guys are located, your hours for folks at home who want to come see you next Wednesday or may want to oh, come yeah, see you this absolutely. week. Absolutely. So we're at uh, 650 St. Louis Street downtown, right there at the corner of Dearborn. Um, we have all our outdoor seating, so you don't have to worry about the social distancing thing. Mm -hmm. Even when it's in these cooler months, we have big gas heaters. Uh, we also have fans during the summer months, so weather's not really an option either. It's covered and everything's perfect. And yeah. 
It's such a cute place, you guys, if you haven't been before. This is a perfect spot. If you and the girls want to get together, if you and your family want a delicious meal, this is definitely the place to go. Now, it looks like our cheese is almost ready. I want to show the folks at home what it looks like. We want to Beautiful. talk about um, maybe some of the other cheeses you have to offer while our friend here gets the cheese ready. Oh, uh, yeah, of course. So uh, we carry tons of different cheeses in the cheese cottage. You can do it on cheese boards. We have pre-made cheese boards, or you can do it. We have, I mean, everything from pecorinos to parms to all the different types of cheddars and goudas. At one time we had 101 in, but you know, not now because of COVID right. restrictions and everything. But at one time we had 101 different types. So uh, really anything you could ever think of, you can come get at the cheese cottage. Wow. All right. So when we come back with Joe, do you think we can show the folks how oh, absolutely. to put the That's cheese on we'll there? Do it. So we're going to do that. I'm so excited to see this. This looks so yummy, guys. Thank you so much right, for coming on you. the show. We'll have more details on the cheese cottage right after this. Joe. Welcome back outside. We are here with the fellows from the Cheese Cottage working on Reclette. This has been such a fun process to walk. Take a look at this cheese over here. So Austin, tell us a little bit about what's going on here. All right, so we got this uh, Reclette. It's good and bubbly right now. It and I certainly think he's about is. Ready to pull it off. Let's we're see gonna how do this works. I want to watch this. So what's in that plate? What's in that bowl right uh, now? So it's potatoes, onions, peppers, and a little pulled pork with some uh, baguette over the top. My and look gosh. At that. Look at all that melty goodness just coming off. So is this something you do at the Cheese Cottage? Yeah, so every Wednesday night in the month of December, we're going to be doing this. There yeah. you go. So if you want to partake in this experience, so that's great because you can do that at the Cheese Cottage. But one of the things we were talking about during the commercial break too is you also do orders to go, curbside pickup, a bunch of stuff like that. Tell us about that. Uh, absolutely. So our entire menu, we do the whole thing to go. It's all packaged up perfect. We also do curbside. We can bring it out to your car if you're worrying about, you know, getting out during the COVID and everything with social sure. distancing. So all of that, we can bring all of this out to your car or everything to go. All right, and where are you guys located so the folks can come see you? Uh, 650 St. Louis Street, right there on St. Louis and Dearborn. All right, and we also mentioned earlier, too, if you're looking for a gift box or uh, some gifts for the Christmas and the holiday season, you guys do a lot of that, too. Absolutely. All of our gift boxes, all of our uh, package stuff up in the front and our cheese cut case and everything you can do for gift boxes. We have a great wine selection if you just want to come out and sit down and have a glass of wine sure. or a bottle of wine. or They make great gifts as well. So. And what are your hours of operation? They are uh, 11 to 8 Tuesday through Saturday and then 12 to 4 on Sundays and then the first Sunday of each month we do a brunch from uh, 10 to 3. Ah, oh, that's yeah. very cool so keep that in mind the brunch the first Sunday of each month. I saw you uh, sprinkling some stuff on top. What, what did you season that with over there? Salt and pepper. And a little Cajun seasoning. Oh and a little Cajun <laughs> seasoning yeah. too. Right. I think uh, Mick has a shot of that finished dish oh, right yeah. now that looks absolutely so fantastic. We can't wait to devour this thing after the show here <laughs> on Studio 10. The Raclette is ready to go if you guys want a great experience featuring a bunch of cheeses, wines, and a whole lot else. You got to come and check out the folks at the Cheese Cottage. Guys, thanks so much for thank joining us. Thank you so much for having us. Really cool that you it. brought that today. Yes, Something new we you. haven't done before on the show. Awesome stuff. All right, y'all. Back to you. Thank you.